Hey, hello, Leah sisters. It's your girl Obaya back with another video. Thank you for tuning back in again today. And if you're new here, hey girl, welcome to the family. In today's video, as you can see, who is there? Who do we have here? Say hi. Hi, hi. <laughs> the original Obaya is here the again. The original Obaya is here again today. And she's going to do my hair. She's going to, oh my gosh, oh my goodness. She's going to do my hair. And for those of you who have been here long enough, you know that I don't let anyone touch my hair, not even my mom. And this is the first time she's doing my hair in a very, 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 very long time. But yeah, I I trust her. Okay, I think I do. Should I uh, should I trust you? <laughs> Anyways, yes. Yeah, so she's going to do my hair. She's going to do the jumbo twist for me because I want to put my hair in a protective style. And yeah, and it's jumbo twist. It's something very easy to do, and it wouldn't put too much tension to my hair. But I'll talk more about it later on in the video so if you're interested in seeing how she does my hair then stay tuned so now without any further ado let's dive right into this video is that all you are saying it to <laughs> <laughs> okay so let's start uh -huh. so um for your information my hair has been i washed my hair the day yesterday so it's a little bit damp still and my hair is not blow dried or blown out or anything. It's not stretched out. So yeah, we will figure out how we're going to part it. She will figure it out. So I'm going to help her if I realize uh, things are not going the way I want to. <laughs> but yeah, for Don't the- Don't worry, I'm going to do it so nice for you. Uh -huh. I'll part it so lightly and so gentle. Okay. You will like it. Yeah, I'm in yeah. God's hands in any yeah. way. <laughs> so this is the hair. I don't know if you can see it's this Brazilian wool hair 100% acrylic because I don't want to be using um, Kinecolon because I learned that it's not really healthy for us to use so I decided that I would use this instead so yeah let's start oh my goodness <laughs> do you need a, a are you a, so excited I'm excited <laughs> <laughs> I am do you need the ratio comb uh, anyway. To part. Yeah, but first yeah, of all, yeah. you use your fingers and then use the. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, of course. Mm -hmm. Guys, I'm nervous. Ah. Then we have to lose the hair first. Yes, then. of course, we'll lose the hair. Right, let me get the comb. Mm -hmm. so, let me get the comb. Where am I to start? Start from the top. Me, top. I'm starting from the back. That's what I mean. I meant to say. It's back. Let me do this. The tongue is saying, say, I was an area. I'm a son of a boob, loose moon. Well, loose moon, then you lose. I don't want any problem. So, my hair, as you can see, is a little bit stretched from the twist that I did yesterday evening. So, yeah, I hope. We can work with it. So don't cry so me team it out. This is guys, this is actually this is a pre premiere. Premiere. This is the first time my mom is touching my hair. <laughs> In eleven Since years. Since you started. Since I started again. eleven years. This is the first time I have allowed my mom to touch to touch my hair. Can you imagine? <laughs> when you say we will trim it, because of me not touching it, so she, she did not allow me to trim it. Yes, that is mm. true. <laughs> okay, so far so good. I I cannot uh, complain. <laughs> but the real task is about to start. Is when we are parting the hair. That is when. We will see if mom, mom is still. Uh, <laughs> 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 if mom will do it the way I like her to do it, but so far I can't complain. What do you think about my hair? I'm doing it gently. Your hair is looking so nice, and with the okra, I think <sighs> now this is the best thing you have yeah, ever found. So, huh? in your hair to detangle in your hair. It's very nice, and your hair is looking shiny and bouncing. It's so and shiny. And it's full. Volume. It's so shiny, guys. Mm, it was a, I mean, 
you would have seen the video of me detangling my hair because i did another one like when i did my hair yesterday the day before that that's when i detangled my hair and i left the ochre in my hair for almost 24 hours or so and by the time i took it out my hair was glistening gl my hair was shining in competition with the sun you wouldn't <laughs> anywho you would have seen it in that video already One side done, and here. <laughs> Look at wait, don't do it like that. It will tangle. It will not tangle. Stop, it will. Hey, this is all hell. This is not Vivono. It's not artificial. It's not wig. You <laughs> now original natural hair. Wow, I am surprised. You know, today is my first day of touching this hair. It seems I'm going to enter better. <laughs> Enter Bethlehem. Bethlehem. Like really? <laughs> Jerusalem. <laughs> wow. They said I wash and go. You can leave it like this. Wash <laughs> and go. Wash well, and go. Well, well, this is wash and twist and go. Wash and twist and go. No, we are not twisting like this. I mean, no. when we twisted it, ah, we, we twisted twist it. Wash yeah. and twist and, and twist out and go. go. Uh, so, uh, <laughs> wash and twist and twist out and go. Oh mm -hmm. my goodness. We have eventually taken everything apart. Wow, wow, Baba, you had a great. Your hair is looking I nice. You, eh? Now I'm trying to you. <laughs> this is, <laughs> this is it. So this is it. This is it. This is it. Natural hair. <laughs> this is it. Okay, so wow. From the back, and this is it from the front. <laughs> so we are about to part it this is where the real work begins because once you finish parting it then it's just a breeze to twist it so yes a handover i'm at your mercy mm -hmm. <laughs> okay i part it and then you straighten it order that is, is what, that I what mean. you mean uh, okay yeah, easy so at this point i would try to help her whenever she encounters tangles that i felt like she wasn't able to get out but for the most part she was doing it all by herself my hair likes to it, see, let, see me here, let, see me show, let me show you how see you here have. part here part mm. here for me here let me show you how you have to do it so that this will not happen because it will keep happening um let me show you you back when i mean you know Where's your hand? Are you in the correct pattern? Why are you straight? It doesn't have to be. It doesn't have to be straight. I Half mean, week. I don't want it really, really centered, centered. As ah. well. It doesn't have to be. But in the beginning, I had to help her a little bit because the way my hair works is different from the way her hair works. She was handling my hair the way she would handle hers, as in the way she would part hers and everything. But my hair is not my hair doesn't react the way hers does so eventually she learned it and then it was okay for her to do it i know it would have been way easier if i had blown up my hair out but i don't use heat in my hair so that is why it's like this so so this is it from mm -hmm. here mm -hmm. you want it like this yes is it okay it's okay mm. Mm, we are progressing mm. <laughs> It was the parting that took the longest and it would have been easier if my hair was stretched but I didn't want to use any kind of heat so yeah. So at this point I was discussing the length for the Brazilian wool with my mom how long I wanted it to be and how thick it should be so that is what we were talking about and then eventually I settled for hip length. I mean, yeah, because that's basically where my hair naturally hits.
So after my mom had parted my hair, we moisturized my hair and retwisted everything again because we decided to keep the twist and twist the hair with the twist. I know it will make sense later when we start twisting, but I'm not going to take my hair out. I'm just going to twist my hair with the Brazilian wool. And yeah, I think it's much easier that way so that my hair doesn't tangle up with the hair, with the Brazilian wool. That is why we decided to do it like that. So guys, we are done parting the hair and we just did each section as we went. So let me just show you how we did it. So that's the back. So it's um, six on each, no, it's eight on each side. So in total we have 16. 16 twists. This is how it's going to be. Let me show you close. tried to do it as straight as possible I think it is I can't really see but yes from what I've got, even like this so this is essentially what I'm doing but in the long version like guys does that make any sense <laughs> <laughs> does that make any sense <laughs> <laughs> anywho but this is essentially essentially the same style I'm doing but with additional um, um, extension and longer so yeah, but this is how it's going to look like when it's done, basically. My mom would do the roots. She would braid the twist with the Brazilian hair. And then after a while, she would pass it on to me. And then I would continue twisting it. So I would push my hair, which is the twist, into the wool hiding it in the wool as I twist. We decided to do it like this to avoid my hair matting up with the hair because we weren't sure how my hair would react with the wool, if my hair would get trapped in the wool because I intend to wear this hair for a while, mm -hmm. a month or six weeks or eight weeks, I don't know. Let's see how, but I'm definitely not going to wear it anything less than six weeks so yes and because of that i didn't want to have to encounter any um traumatic experience where my hair has matted with the wool so we decided to keep my hair in the twists which i think would make it much easier when i take my hair down and washing and everything so that was the idea behind everything so i don't know if you can really tell what i'm doing but i'm twisting the hair and I'm pushing my twist in between the hair so that I can hide my twist in the hair. So that's what I do. So before I twist, I make sure that my hair is inside so it doesn't show. So like I said, I would twist the hair. My mom would do the roots. I would twist the length of the hair when it gets to a point and my mom will continue at the end. And by that time, she would have started another twist and then we would just keep on switching. So with that, it went faster. My mom does braids, but that's what she's used to doing braids. She's not so much used to doing twists, okay? So that is why um, I would do most of the length of the hair as much as I could. And she would do the roots for me. But yeah, it was a very nice teamwork. The twisting part went really fast. The majority of the time went when we had to part the hair. I say we, as if I, yeah, well, I helped a little in the beginning, but later on she figured out how to handle my hair and to avoid tangles. She parted my hair and that took long because of the fact that my hair wasn't stretched and the curls just didn't want to separate. They wanted to stay together. Because of the lockdown, you know, there was curfew up until nine o'clock. And we weren't done until 8.30, so she wouldn't get home before the curfew, so she had to sleep over. So we finished twisting the hair that evening.
and this is it guys this is how the hair looks like all done but it was left with the ends and because it was evening and it was late we were both tired and we decided to do the ends the next day I know the twists aren't entirely perfect but I just like the I just like the look it just looks mm, natural it makes it look more natural because of the different shapes and sizes it just looks more organic if that makes sense But as you can see the hair has different length because as I was cutting it I wasn't really accurate when cutting it when cutting it so some hair are longer than others which we would fix the next day so at this point we were just tired and we just left it as it is I didn't record us fixing the end or burning the end because in the morning we, were, we just wanted to do it fast and get it over with but I'll pop in and show you guys how my hair looks like after two weeks of wearing the hair and how the ends look like and how we burnt the ends. I mean, not how we burnt the ends, but I'm going to pop in now and show you guys how my hair looks like after two weeks of wearing it. Hey, hey sisters, it's me two weeks later with my edges laid and all. <laughs> yes, I just used water and my cream a little bit of shea butter and a little bit of oil and then I tied my hair down with a scarf and this is how it looks like this is how my edges look like and yeah the hair is still holding up I feel like the hair looks better the older it gets the more older it gets the more natural it looks the more natural it looks yeah so let me not keep you waiting let me show you let me show you how it looks like now so I use a stocking to tie my hair because it's so much easier and this is how the hair is currently looking like ouch these rings are not helping at all after two weeks of me having this hair okay as you can see here the end was burned So this is how the ends look like for each of the twists and I just added some accessories, some jewelry, some twists accessories to the hair here and there, you know, and I just like how it looks, it doesn't really look uniform. The twists are not all perfect or not all the same size but I, that is what I like about it for some reason I just like it just gives it a more it just gives it a more natural look okay let me show you how it looks like from the back as well so this is the hair from the back let me stand up and show you <laughs> so as you can see we were able to fix the end somehow but there are still some twists that are shorter these ones not these ones these i can't these ones for instance are a little bit where is it like this one is a little bit shorter but when you stretch it is actually not so but yeah this is how it looks like yeah guys so that's it i'm probably going to keep these twist in for maybe not anything less than six weeks like i said because i really like it i can enjoy it and i don't have anything hindering me i can put it in a bun i can put it in a yeah anyhow if you're interested in seeing how i would style these twists and leave it in the comments down below and then i might shoot a video showing you different styling options with these twists okay but i would only do it if you guys are interested in it so just comment down below and yeah i can make that video happen yeah and my experience with my mom doing my hair yeah <laughs> it wasn't as bad as i thought it would be honestly it wasn't as bad as i thought it would be she was gentle enough she was patient enough she was yeah, she handled my hair with care, especially because she knew I was going to say, I was going to tell if she didn't, but she did everything right and I can't complain. So I definitely would trust her again with my hair next time. 
and this is going to be something that we're going to be doing more often that would help me with doing my hair if I decided to do an extension or something like that so yeah you might see more of these videos coming in the future where she does my hair she was supposed to tell her own experience with how she felt when handling my hair so maybe in a different video she'll just tell you how she felt okay when she comes again then we will do that video where she will talk about her experience with dealing with my hair okay so guys that's it for today's video i hope you liked it and if you did don't forget to give this video a like and to subscribe if you haven't already and also to turn on the notification bell so that you are notified when my next video goes up i love you guys so 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 much see you in my next video stay blessed stay healthy and stay safe it is your girl obaya hey hey Bye. Hey. Hey. Bye. Bye. Mm -hmm.